Hello! In this video we will demonstrate how to replicate the app templates between VMware Cloud Director catalogs. It is important to mention that uh, to have this functionality, a mandatory requirement is to activate custom SLA settings on the replication policy assigned to the organization. Now let's proceed with the replication. The menu is slightly redesigned with a new protection button added just next to the new migration. The first step in protecting a VApp template is to pick the source catalog, one or multiple templates and the destination site. Next, the destination VDC and storage policy need to be selected for the VApp to be placed before importing it to the catalog. The last part of the protection configuration is to define whether VMware Cloud Direct availability should look for changes in the source and how to act if it detects any. If track source changes is activated, there will be regular checks every 5 minutes for any changes to the source template. If one is detected, a new protection will be configured for the latest version of the template, while the old protection will be deleted. The recovery settings will be copied automatically. Please note, they can be set only before the initial migration. Delay start synchronization defines an interval for when tracking changes and automated actions will occur. They can start only during the specified time frame, but might finish outside of it. Automatic migrate behavior specifies whether the VApp template will be overwritten at the destination or a new copy will be added to the catalog, keeping the old version unchanged. The automatic migration, the initial migration should be performed manually and the protection should be in failed over recovery state. Once the configuration is finished and the initial sync is performed, we can see the overall health becomes green. Now let's manually migrate this VApp template. First, we need to select the destination catalog, then the network settings and finalize the wizard. The migration process is completed successfully and the recovery state is changed to failed over. This means two things, the VApp template is already present at the destination catalog and for every change of the source, an automated migration will be initiated for every new protection. In this case, VMware Cloud Director Availability will create a new copy of the template because I selected this option for automatic migrate behavior setting. To validate that, I will overwrite the source VApp template by editing the compute of its VM. During the next check, VMware Cloud Director Availability detects a change. Because of that, it creates a new protection for the last version of the template. Because the initial migration was already performed, it will be automatically migrated, resulting in a new template copy at the destination catalog. We can see it successfully created with all the changes in place. This is how easy it is to replicate the app templates between multiple Cloud Director catalogs. Thanks for watching.